Okay, what we got here is a uh, <clears throat> prototyping system for vacuum tube radios. It's capable of running the uh, KT88s and large end as well as small uh, vacuum tubes. <clears throat> Some of the sockets and the <clears throat> covers. It's gonna, the vacuum tubes will be air cooled. <clears throat> We've got shrouds and we have uh, cooling on it. It's a peak inside of the uh, <clears throat> case. It's going to have a copper. Uh, bus system for uh, radio frequency ground. It's got a uh, crystal that you can change out. It's also have a <clears throat> function generator input so you can run a BNC and run uh, different frequencies. It's basically a uh, ISM uh, power supply to run uh, industrial, scientific, medical uh, experiments or, or whatever you need. It's in the uh, 6 megahertz up to over 27 megahertz is what it's designed to run. It's got the uh, adjustable Pi network in the back. We'll show you that in a minute. This is the uh, regulated filament power supply for the uh, vacuum tubes. Uh, you got a 10-turn pot on here to control the uh, the filaments. This also locks out uh, <clears throat> the case, aluminum and steel case. It's going to have six. Uh, uh, adjustable air capacitors in here, tune different uh, circuits. You can have uh, pin jacks here to check the uh, cat amperages and frequencies. Uh, you got a digital uh, frequency meter here that's going to be in, in here also. Right now we're running about 900 volts, yeah, about 17 milliamps, and the uh, yeah, the thermometer here, you can barely see. It's running over 100 and, uh, 180 degrees right now after a minute or two. We're going to turn the fan on to cool that. you got a uh, <clears throat> power resistor here. It's a 50 uh, a kilo ohm uh, wire wound resistor. I wanted to show, this is the... Uh, this is on uh, five uh, millivolts. That's how clean that thing is. This is uh, if you run this up to that's 0.1 volts. Very clean. We got a the power supply. It's got uh, 900 volts. Uh, at 500 uh, microfarad capacitor filters in here, as well as some uh, DC chokes. Uh, it's a regulator for the uh, filament right here, power supply. So you got two power supplies in here. This is the filter box. The transformer uh, box is going to be on top of that. It's all in steel encased. It's all, these are all hammered. Uh, that's the 278CX. We have a different one that's going to go in here. It runs over. Uh, well, this one here is good for 800 volts center tap. Yeah, we're running a. This is a microwave oven uh, <clears throat> diodes, CNT uh, 517s for a full bridge, and then it's uh, filtered in this box here. And we'll show you the uh, Pi network on the back here. Some of the other controls. It's all going to be in a book here, writing a book with drawings and schematics and all that. You'll be able to get that here on on our website. That's the uh, regulator. Heat sink's going to be air-cooled. This is Pi network here, adjustable. You can tune the Pi network right here, as well as the uh, over here. These are uh, three or four or five turn air chokes. 50 cycle or 50 ohm uh, RF output. Crystal, change of crystal here. Crystal amperage here. You got to run BNC input here. Switch it either one crystal controlled or you can run your own function generator to control it. And this is the uh, high voltage in. And this is also the uh, six volts DC in. This. These are uh, coax, special coax we designed, twisted cable with the shielding on the outside. Keep the uh, radio frequency from transmitting. 
So there you have it.